Sure. Um, I mean, it, it's I've had my I have custody of my kids since 2007. I got two boys, uh, 13, and my youngest one. He's actually gonna be 12 three days uh, after I fight in Australia. Um, but you know, people think that just because you are, are a male that uh, life is easier for you or that things are, are easier for you to, to accomplish. But be, honestly, man, being a single parent, being a single father is hard because they look at you like, okay, you're a man, you got everything figured out, everything. But it doesn't work like that. <clears throat> you know, like, I haven't got any child support. Like, I'm supposed to get child support. I don't get any child support. I do everything on my own. Um, you know, I have to wake up in the morning for my kids, you know, um, you know, cook breakfast, you know, iron clothes, do hair, uh, you know, drop them off at school. I, at that time, I was having to go work eight to eight to five, then come home, do homework, uh, you know, make sure everything was in cook, you know, make sure everything was in order for them. So when we got back from training that everything was running through so they can go to bed and, you know, then I'll come train at eight o'clock, don't get home till like 10 o'clock, 1030. Uh, and then on top of that, you know, uh, get home, get them in the bed, get them situated, and wake up the next day at six o'clock in the morning. Just a repeated cycle every single day, you know. And it's hard, man. It's hard trying to do it on your own. And the way I can say it, kind of, it, it didn't put a chip on my shoulder, but it motivated me. It motivated me before the simple fact that I looked at myself and I saw how I was accomplishing what all these guys in MMA was already accomplishing. And I was doing it in one fourth the amount of time that they were doing it in. Like they were doing it like they had full fight camps. Like they can go train twice, three times a day. I'm training once at once at night for two hours, three hours. And I'm still having to take care of my single father responsibilities. And I'm doing, if not just as good or better as these guys. I'm going out there knocking guys out. They're going out there going to decisions. So it actually was motivation. I was like, okay, if y'all can do it, then all right, you know what? I'm not gonna use this as an excuse. And it helps my kids, you know, it's like my kids, my kids are very successful. They're, they're, you know, they're straight A, so they haven't made anything less than A since they've been in, been in school. Ever since kindergarten, they've, they've made nothing but straight A's. And it, trans, it transitions over into their life. So they're, they're, they're great athletes, they're A honor roll students. I mean, they're just great kids, they're great human beings. So it teaches them and it taught them, they follow my footsteps because it shows them hard work. Because I mean, if my daddy can do this, then why can't I do this? And my kids are very, very accomplished in what they choose to do in school as far as, far as football, basketball, and wrestling. And uh, the school is number one. So it's very motivating, man. It's good to see that my kids, um, that they love, that I can inspire them, that they love seeing what I do and, and watching how they watch me and then they transition it over into their life. So that was my motivation. So it wasn't like really a chip on my shoulder, it was just more like, okay, like this, okay, this is what we're going to do. Uh, I'm, I'm going to put this work in. I'm going to show my kids what it is to work hard and what it is to be a real man. And they follow in the footsteps. And now it's got me to the UFC. And now I'm only going to go up from here, man. It's only, it's only fuel, fuel to the fire.